Holyoke Public Schools is looking to fill more than 100 open positions at a hiring event tomorrow at the Holyoke Mall. Western Mass News reporter Rakin Lokri is getting answers on current staffing levels and what positions are open. Staffing numbers for Holyoke Public Schools are looking much better this school year than last. We're getting answers on why that is and which positions still need to be filled. Holyoke Public Schools are currently looking to hire 53 teaching positions, primarily in special education, math and science. 32 paraeducator positions primarily serving students with high and severe needs, as well as 51 other positions in a variety of job classes, primarily based in schools or in central supply. The district's assistant superintendent, Stephen Mahoney, tells Western Mass News these numbers for the 2024-2025 school year are much better than what the district saw last year. Mahoney explains that's because the district has since instituted incentives such as professional development as well as more support for teachers in the classroom. He says this has helped to boost their numbers. However, he feels switching their focus to retention rather than just recruitment has really made the difference. We put in a considerable effort to understanding uh, teacher retention and how we could uh, increase teacher retention. Um, I think that 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 effort to understand and then uh, the plans and the systems that we put in place to support teacher retention had an impact um, on uh, on our, our staffing numbers this year. Mahoney says another piece of the puzzle is how they have evolved from the COVID-19 pandemic. He explains that when they first were able to go back to the classroom, the main focus was getting students back on track academically. However, now they are able to focus more on mental health as well. Once we felt we had structures and systems uh, and curricula in place, we then turned to uh, really turning to social emotional um, uh, supports for students and behavioral supports for students. As for job seekers, Mahoney tells us it is not a requirement to be bilingual unless you are applying to work in the dual language program. However, it is a plus when staff members are able to speak a multitude of languages, including Spanish, French, or Arabic. Our need for multilingual uh, staff has grown as we have diversified the number of, of folks who are uh, coming into our uh, school system as newcomers. Reporting in Holyoke, Reagan Lokery for Western Mass News.